Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of each and every effect in Adobe Premiere Pro. Today we're going to learn how you can use a audio filter name a 50 filter. So here in Adobe Premiere Pro, I have opened a new project and there I have imported a clip. Here I want to demonstrate how you can use the FFT filter. So what does the FFT filter actually do? FFT filter is a kind of equalizer. Suppose when you're using parametric equalizer, 10 band equalizer, it will work like that. So if I show you, if I go here, effects panel and there I can go audio effects folder and under audio effects folder there is a folder called filter and eq if you click here you will see there are some effect and here also fft filter is available to apply the effect click and drag it here and there you will see it have been applied on this effects control panel if you don't see effects control again go to window enable effects control and from there if i go to edit section of fft filter i can alter the things in the fft filter the audio have been divided into frequency from 0 hertz to 20,000 kilohertz if i show you here is the 0 hertz and here is the 20,000 kilohertz there are two different way to view this section one is linear view here the part is very equally divided and again you can select logarithmic view and there you will see that is not divided equally for me i prefer logarithmic view i will suggest you to use this one because it will show the audio waveform properly when you are editing you can understand very easily right so if i play it back my audio clip hey guys this is james and welcome so to it a is new sounding episode pretty normal H suppose i want to add a low cut filter i want to eliminate the volume from 100 hertz to 0 hertz what i can do i can add a point here on this 100 hertz section if i just click there i can add a point and then i can click and drag this section and there I can also make it very aggressive. Now it is apparently applying a low cut filter. So when you are recording, suppose there are some rumbling microphone noise or when you are recording, you have used air conditioner. So there is an air conditioner noise. You want to eliminate those sound. You can use the low cut filter just like that. Now if I play it back, if there is any air conditioning noise or rumbling sound, it will be eliminated totally hey guys this is james and welcome to a new again if you want to decrease the high pitch volume of your voice suppose your voice produce a lot of high frequencies that doesn't sound very pleasing right you want to decrease that part so you can just add a point here and a point there and then you can just click and drag this section to decrease that high pitch sound apparently we are applying a deezer filter right so if i play it back set up each and every effect in Adobe it will Premier eliminate Pro. that today we're going to learn sound. about the audio effect name a50 and also here you can enable a spline curves it will give you more control when you are changing things by applying a spline curves you can have gradual adjustment rather than having a very aggressive uh, effect right so that is the thing you can also use some presets suppose if i want to use a deezer i can select a preset it will change the scale i can just go to logarithmic view so here you can see it is apparently done the same thing we did before again if you want to use a low cut filter you can use this one kill the mic rumble it is applying a low cut filter and again you can reset it using this option so if you want to reset it anytime you can do it so that's it that is the basic of how you can use a fft filter in adobe premiere pro i don't use it that much i prefer using low cut filter or parametric equalizer that we are going to talk about very soon here on this series i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up if you're in this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then Goodbye.